So when you bust a nut, that's your kid, the DNA Lab Center. Make sure you get that. Get that. <laughs> DNA Lab Center. Does he really have his father's eyes? Oh, oh that shit. shit. Hell, that's crazy. Only in Brooklyn. Oh. And they're advertising on the fucking, uh, oh, on the fucking truck. Only in Brooklyn, man. That's a taxi. That's a cab. That's a cab. Yeah. That's a cab. Yeah, that's a cab. Oh, that's a dollar van. That's a dollar van. Yeah, they ride through here. Oh shit, it's a dollar van with a sponsor. <laughs> oh my god, New Yorkers, we've upgraded. Between <laughs> Bedford and Bedford. So when, so when you bust a nut, fellas, make sure if the kid ain't yours, call up the DNA Lab Center. <laughs> oh, peace of mind, court DNA. Oh, she had me all up and down this motherfucker. Picking up from that, from the fucking um, hair salon, Oh my God! Do you and me the same time? Same, 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 same. <laughs> Let's get it popping. Yeah. Mike's on. Yeah, Mike is on. Yeah, it's going now. DJ Chuck, chill out, young star. Yeah, you know what it is. We in the building. We are, right now we discussing how crazy and hectic this music business is with this internet shit. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Give Give us some knowledge, there, brother. Okay. We just got some statistics that's scary. In a country of 300 million people, Where? at any given time, only 90,000 people are watching BET. That's not a good look. Compared. That's not a good look. And I also, somebody told me today that radio and a couple of these video companies are going to go under in the next two years. That is scary. You radio cats out there better adapt and make the transition because we will be out of work soon. This computer shit is very fucking nervous. Do you want to know why that shit is happening? Because it's so much easier for an up-and-coming artist like myself to make a video, throw it on YouTube, and 450,000 people watch it than it is to me and go kiss somebody's ass. <laughs> what it is, is everybody got greedy, and we all fucked the game up. No. It's no one person to blame. This, this computer... Fucked everything up. No, I wouldn't say that. Um, it fucked everything. It put a lot of people out of work. Put a lot of people out of work. Jeremy. You can't blame it on the computer because if the fucking companies wasn't such dickheads, we wouldn't need the computer. <laughs> we ran to the computer because y'all was like I shouldn't say y'all because you had nothing to do with that. <laughs> if they was dead in us, and I, I, I am gonna say y'all because every DJ ain't as real as you. True. Every DJ ain't as real as you. There's some DJs. Yeah, I'll play your single for ten thousand. Uh, what? Uh, no, I'm not doing that. What? Yeah. You got a hot record, I'm playing it. It's going down. But I used, I used to understand, man, how the young generation don't buy nothing. They, they just download all the music. That's so how how do you make money? This is don't say it like that. Did we do buy something? We even yeah, you, know, you, you buy something when there's, there's a hype week. behind it. You buy something when there's hype behind it. You when it's it. hot, we buy. It. Yeah, you do. Cause Lil Wayne was a lot of hype. In Platinum in a week. True, true. So people are still buying. Record. People will but buy then, records. But then there's other artists out here like Mano that sold 18,000 units, and that's fucking nervous. I don't understand that. That's nervous. I don't understand that. Well, tell you the honest to God, true. I don't, well, we we then, don't then even know the whole story then behind Then Sierra that. album come out first week, 20,000. What, what is that? I don't, that's scary, man. That's scary. That's scary. That's some scary shit. That's some scary shit, man. So, so what you're telling me is that only certain artists are selling it, but you gotta create a hype to put shit out there. Pretty much. It is different. When artists used to come out before, people used to get hype behind it. Now, it's just like people are putting out such bad music, there's no reason to be hype. Yeah, and then people generalize. So then people start going, it's oh, not just this artist, it's oh, everybody. This fool yeah, that was some real sucker shit. See, now you bringing the niggas out. Who is this character? See, now now we're going to get on some real defamation type shit. If you see this license plate right here, cut the tires off. I said it. You reckless young boy. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Here's the entertainment.
<laughs> so you wanted to see us act reckless, so we <laughs> yo, you yo, wanted to see us yo, act he, reckless. He so zoomed, he almost hit me, almost hit me. He yeah, almost he, hit me. I mean, I saw it. They didn't get to see it, but I he saw it. He almost hit me, man. Woohoo. Wow. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Only, only in New York City. It's the best city ever, though. Where? Let's face it. So, <laughs> this is what a dent is going to do. Yo, word. <laughs> Let's just put a big dent in you. You're telling him to do something. He ain't gonna do nothing. He ain't gonna do nothing. He ain't gonna do nothing at all. He just zoomed across. That probably ain't his car. Who cares? Yeah, well. Only, only in New York. You gotta find a way to seriously create a brand. <laughs> you said, here's the. Here's the entertainment. Here's the entertainment. <laughs> here's the entertainment <laughs> they wanna see people do real things. That's right. Know? Chuck Child is real from the Boogie Down Bronx. Another thing, could I take this time to say, please stop hating on Soldier Boy. He's a genius. Yeah, he, I'm feeling him. He's a genius. I'm Seriously. feeling him. I'm feeling Soldier. I'm no, not, not you, but there's other people who be like, he's a genius. I'm Soldier him. Boy makes music that I'm young feeling, people want to hear. I'm feeling him. I'm feeling him. I like some of his stuff. I like some of his stuff. Tell him, Young Star 63. For real. For real. That's right, baby. For real. We're going through the Holland Tunnel. We in the Denali XL Lodge. We rolling deep. We ain't gotta tell you what year it is. Just guess. <laughs> Just guess. Yeah, we answer that bitch. Hey. Peace. <laughs> that was.